Welcome back everyone, I'm Craven and this is Rhapsody. We are, I think, roughly halfway up this gigantic volcano and last time we accidentally defeated the guardian of the place. So I'm gonna think there might be some unforeseen consequences. So let's uh, start to head up further up the mountain and look for the egg the guardian just laid because that was the last thing we heard last time from uh, the enemy it's actually here it's a huge egg uh, can't we do anything with that we should be able to do something with that right So, uh, very determined. Eh, no. <laughs> okay, so we found the egg. I have just no idea what we can do with that. There's some more protectors of the egg. Be more careful because I can't attack with uh, Cornet just now. Just so, do we need to keep fighting here until we come across a certain monster? I'm confused. I want to do something for the egg. Maybe we need to come back later when um, it hashes. And the fact that we defeated the Guardian, when we go back to town, maybe trouble will arise because of the volcano maybe erupting. Maybe that's gonna be the thing that's gonna happen. All right, so let's head back down the mountain and go see what's up in uh, Red Hot. Teleporter, really useful. <laughs> hmm, it's so quiet here. Something's not right, don't you think? <coughs> yeah, that screeching. Can't get used to it. Oh, did you hear that? <laughs> That's a dragon's cry. Let's check it out. Strange. The old man said that he's going back to the volcano. Damn, I, I think I just stole his, all his uh, saved up money. <laughs> oh, everybody went to slay the dragons. I came to look for the prince, but where is he? Maybe I should go look for girls instead. Or you help the town protect it from dragons, come on. Oh, the volcanoes erupt when a dragon dies? Oh, people are so full of it. Okay, so there's no way to go there at least. And you know what I saw? I saw a lady with the black wings flying towards the mountains. Strange. Everybody went to slay the dragons after they saw you go in alone. They were afraid of the dragons, but <laughs> you never know until you try. Well, let's be honest. We already defeated the Guardian. Yeah, I don't think the rest of the village will uh, be able to do much. Oh, we'll have peace in this town once the dragons are gone. Hey, have you found the prince yet? No? No, we haven't.
So I'm guessing we need to go back up the mountain towards the egg. And we're probably gonna find the townspeople there trying to destroy the egg. And I feel like we need to protect that egg. All right, let's see if we can find the villagers here. If they're not here, I don't know where they are. And maybe we need to really thoroughly search the volcano. Because there was one location that we really needed to walk a lot where there was nothing there. But this might be a good location to check first. Oh, thank you for motivating us. I can safely say that the crisis is over. In return, I will give you the stone that the dragon was carrying. Acquired fire stone. Oh, we finally did it. We'll have peace once again. It was my blow that struck it down. I'll be a hero. Guardian? Huh. It was a harbinger of disaster. It deserved no better. Mayor, we'll bring the egg back to the village and destroy it. We don't want any more dragons. Ah! It's an earthquake! Oh no, this must be the curse of the dragon. Let's get out of here. <gasps> oh, that actually looks cool. Cornette, we should get out of here too. Cornette, it's time to make like a sheep herder and get the flock out of here. <laughs> That's actually a really good one. But the egg. <laughs> it's so heavy. What do you have in mind? Kururu, this horn will grant our wishes, right? Cornette. Acquired Dragon's Egg. <laughs> Let's hurry. Oh, I'm too young to die. Hmm, I have been expecting you. It looks like you're, you found the Firestone. Now give it to me. There's no time for this. Oh, now you're gonna attack us, really? Our mega scent in order to damage it. Okay, that did a lot of damage already. Perfect. I think we're gonna stay there. Mega sleep, mega poison. I kinda wanna do mega poison, but let's do go with Meteor. <laughs> oh, he even got her all gone in the first round. Perfect. Now we just need to survive uh, these uh, griffins. What should we do, Kururu? The lava surrounding us. I don't know about you, Cornette, but I can fly. Hmm, quickly, hold on to me. Why did she save us? Why? Why did you save me? Because you have some unfinished business. Look behind you. Live and pay for your crimes against nature. I'll let you keep the Firestone to remind you of your shame. My shame? Until we meet again. Huh? Uh, hey Cornette, I think it's our responsibility to raise that baby dragon. It's the least we can do, so let's take it with us. I agree. And it's making such cute noises, we definitely need to take it with us. 
flare turned into a puppet and joined the party. Perfect, so we got even more different unique puppets. How can I pick which one to use? Because the party that we have right now is very effective. But uh, do let me know in the comment if you want to see another composition of our party. Because I'd be more than willing to do that and raise them up as well. Because it might be interesting to fight with Flare. Who knows? If we level the baby dragon up, maybe it will grow bigger in the process as well. And if that happens, that would be really cool. The Marjorie family is so cool. Kidnapping the one you love. That's what you call girl power. No, that's what you call a crime. <laughs> Ashes from the volcano are destroying our crops and poisoning our water. All of our hard work flushed down the toilet. What did we do to deserve this? You killed a dragon. That's what you did. Oh, why did my grandpa have to die? He taught me everything. He even taught me how to operate a bridge. Would you like to know how to operate a bridge? Yes. But does it mean that the old guy that was living here just died from going to the volcano and back here? Is that part of the curse too? Damn. You do not mess around with dragons. First, turn on the second and sixth switches from the top. You'll hear a sound when uh, you've done it correctly. After that, Turn off the second and sixth switches. Then flip the first, fifth and sixth switches. Did you get that? Would you like me to repeat it? I think I need you to repeat it and I think in edit I will probably write this down because I'm never going to remind, uh, re remind myself of that. So from heart, two and six on and two and six down. Then flip the first, fifth, and sixth. So the first and the two last ones. Nah, I think I'm good. Okay, good luck. Uh, the eruptions could change the environment around here drastically. The dragons are gone, but the town isn't ready to start rebuilding yet. Why does things like this happen one after the other? What did we do to deserve this? Well, you went out, killed a dragon without even considering what the consequences would be. Even knowing that it is named a guardian for a reason, but yeah. Hey, have you found the prince yet? No? Oh, we'll have uh, peace in this town once the dragons are gone. Thank you, I can finally get a good night's sleep. I came looking for the prince. Maybe we should go look for girls instead. The eruption volcano like the fury of the mountain god. So is it true that the dragons keep watch over the volcanoes? It does seem like that, doesn't it? Oh, the righteous will always prevail. You hope that, but that's not necessarily true. You know what I saw? I saw a lady with black wings. Winged people? I've heard about the ancient people having wings that allowed them to fly. Oh, I'm thankful that you slayed the dragon that killed my husband. Yeah, I think if you knew what kind of consequences it had, you wouldn't be that grateful. Oh well. Small little hill. And uh, I'm guessing we're going back to the bridge and start Trying to flip the switches. Oh, careful. Man, I can't go looking for the prince like this. I need to get over White Snow ASAP. Hey, bridge guy, what's going on? Hmm, the ancient people made a puppet utilizing the binary system. Do you know what that means? I didn't think so. Can we push this kid into the water? I don't think anyone would know if we did. Maybe my son is a genius. Or maybe your son is just an asshole. 
a bit harsh to say about the kid, but you know what I mean. I went to Red Hot, but I couldn't find the former guard of the bridge. What should I do? I wonder what the numbers 34 and 49 mean. I don't know either. Oh, the former guard forgot to take me with him. He was a nice man. I wonder what he's doing right now. He died. He died so much. Alright. There's one... And there's two and six. Should we get a response now that we did the right thing? Okay. Now... One... Five... And... Okay, now we get a response. So it's one on top and six at the bottom. Okay. So let's start from here. Okay, then press one, five, and six. There's a voice outside. The suspension bridge! It's down! Wow! It's about time! The other soldiers are busy looking for the prince. Should I stand here like this when everybody else is busy looking? Yes, somebody needs to guard this place, even if other people won't. Well, at least the little genius is gone, and oh, it looks like all the bridges are down too as well. Okay, so we got the oasis. Uh, I want to go back and exit the other side as well. So we have both new locations on the map. And we got the ice temple here. So which one would be the first one for us to do? I really doubt it matters, actually. But before we head into either one of those, uh, let's have a quick look at the Cape of Hope. I want to see if I can place the Firestone already here, or if I need to keep it with me. Having said that, I don't even know on which one the Firestone actually needs to reside. If this doesn't work out, then it means we have to keep every stone with us until we're done. Yep, I think that's it. Alright, I'm just going to go randomly to the first location I see, and that is the Oasis. Oh, the town of Oasis was built by the miners who worked in the Enothium mine. Sir Rosenqueen is the owner of this mine. Are we gonna meet uh, with a twall here? Or are we gonna see your family? Oh, it's been so long since my daughter disappeared. I don't even see her in my dreams anymore. That's actually sad. <laughs> the maiden uh, here used to take good care of me. I wonder where she is right now. A few years ago, people started disappearing from the mine. I came looking for the prince, but I haven't found Jack. I've, I've been standing here picking my nose the whole time. Okay, a little bit too much information, but you should be le looking for Prince Ferdinand and not Jack. Because Jack is not the person that's missing. Hmm. My grandson has the key to open the Notium mine. So where is he? I told Lady Etoile not to go into the mine to look uh, for the windstone, but she insisted and went ahead anyway. She even locked the door behind her so that nobody would come after her. <laughs> That's why I sent my grandson to report this to Sir Rosenqueen. Okay, so just like an indication that we need to go to the other location first. Hmm, a few days ago, some dumb guy asked me if I knew how to get to Cape Hope. Lady Etoile has become such a beautiful girl. I remember when she was just a child. Uh, fighter's Charm and Cat Paw. Not bad objects, but I wanted something a little bit more unique. 
At least we can get maximum healing item for here for 800, which isn't actually too bad, to be honest. Thank you very much for doing nothing. I can't find Grandpa. Oh, where did Grandpa go? Should have been running around. He could get hurt. He might be in the mine, trying to uh, go off to Etoile. It's another mine? The door is locked. A few years ago, people started disappearing from the mine. Okay, so, but where is the guy with the key? My grandson has the key to open the note to your mind yet, yeah, but where is he? Okay. Is there any indicator in the house on where the grandson is? To report this to Sir Rosenqueen. But where is Sir Rosenqueen? I know who he is. He's the father of A12, but... Would he be hiding in Mother Green then, maybe? Because we have heard that uh, Lady A12 was, has locked herself up in the room. Even though it's clearly she's on the hunt for the stones as well. Okay, so we might need to look around for where Sir Rosenqueen is uh, hiding out. Maybe have a quick look at the Ice Temple while we're at it. Then in between episodes I can uh, search for where uh, he's hiding. I'm pretty sure it's somewhere in Mother Queen. Mother Queen? Mother Green. White snow, a bridge to the lake. So it's just a, let's just say, a, a mountain we need to get through. With maybe a hidden temple in the middle. Ah, that was not what I wanted to do. Good. Miss all you want. Ah, not too bad. We can handle these. Giga Holy and Charm. Yeah, they really are fighting up a storm, aren't they? <laughs> this time, you gotta move, girl. They still miss quite often, so I'm happy with that. And the damage they do do is not that bad. We can definitely handle that. Found para gum. All right, let's just keep going in a singular direction, hoping we picked the wrong one. Might be going into the right direction again, so there's still a lot of places we can uh, explore in here, but so funny when the monster in the back can't see a way towards us that he just doesn't do anything. <laughs> oh well, your own fault. Then you should have tried at least something to attack me. Dead end. Perfect. 
would be nice if we can find a way through this before the end of the episode. I think we should be able to, right? And another dead end. With the potential of there being something there in the future, like a unique monster, but... Again, only speculation. For now, we need to find a way to the actual temple, or to the way out of here. Because this bit also will just be normal mountain, which they call a temple, but nothing templish is going on here. Those would be like this is the perfect time to find another musical chest or item because we have found one chest in the castle and one plant pot in Blue Cat that sang the song. I don't want to find the others too, but I'm pretty sure there's more than that. And we're out! We still have a few uh, alleyways in that mountain to explore, but. At least we saw the other side, and now we have access to white snow. Damn. In the last couple of episodes, we've opened up a lot of the areas uh, on the map already, which is really cool. Uh, Could the party receive the blessing for the statue? Yes. But the only thing we need to find more is where is the location of Mr. Rosenqueen for the key to the mine. And that way we have two areas where we can find potential elemental stones to decurse the prince. And if we find all the stones, we just have to find the prince to actually use that magic on. But yeah, for now I'm gonna leave it here. We've uh, done and opened up a lot today, which is really good. So next time we're gonna explore this town. And of course, see if we can find Mr. Rosenqueen to open up the mine in Oasis. But for now, I wish you all a great night, morning, day, wherever you are. And if you're still here, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and be back next time as we go on the hunt for Mr. Rosenqueen. Bye-bye.